Welcome to Karat. Some people believe you can make a difference here, Jenny. This is the moment of truth. In part two of our trip through the regions of Karat, we travel north to explore the vast forests and brutal blood sports of the Midlands, and further up to brave the heights and savagery of the mighty Himalayas. The Midlands are home to beautiful vistas, exotic animal life, and the well-oiled machines of Karat's booming drug trade, supervised by Dr. Noor Najjar, Vice Lord of Karat. Noor also runs the deadly contests of the Shanath Arena. Let the bang The centuries-old karate tradition pits wolves and tigers against gladiators in a fight to the dead. But the violence and brutality of the arena is nothing compared to what you'll face once you reach the wicked windswept peaks of the Himalayas. They are patrolled by the Royal Army's elite, as well as ravenous wolves and snow leopards. Life up here is a near-death experience. Falling dream? A lot of people fall around here. Most of them don't wake up. Watch your step. The steep inclines and sheer drop-offs are prone to frequent avalanches. Hello! You have been a naughty little shit, haven't you? King Pagan Min sends Karat's political prisoners to the Sky Prison. Welcome to Degesh. A craggy gulag carved into the side of a mountain. The warden is Yuma, a former triad gangster and commander of the elite royal guard. What was that? Let's stop playing this game. You both know what you really want. To survive the hostile conditions, you need to pack heat from your grappling hook and wingsuit, to throwing knives and heavy machine guns, and your deadliest weapon, your surroundings. It's good to have you with us, brother. We've explored the lush wetlands, hillside forests, bloody arenas, and deadly heights. But you won't truly find what you're looking for until you find yourself in Karat.